The Bible doesn't tell us why everybody sins. It just tells us that everybody sins. Now, the moment that you try to go beyond the scripture, you're in metaphysics, or you're in philosophy. And it behooves us to stay in the scripture. Now, the scripture does not tell us why everybody sins. There's a lot of theories floating around, but I'm going to stick with the word of God. You ask me, well, why did everybody sin? I don't know. And I don't think anybody else does, because God never told us why. He tells us that all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. And just between you and me, i got enough problem with the things he has told us that I can't spend a lot of time worrying about the things he hasn't told us. And he never told us why, but he did tell us that. Reaching the age of accountability, every one of us chose as the principle by which we would live I am going to do what I want to do. Now, maybe some were far more refined and cultured than others, and they didn't put their fist in the face of God and say, I'm going to do what I want to do. They may have just said, well, I'm going to do what I really want to do. I mean, I don't care whether they're up and out or down and out. The fact is, the scripture says they're out. All of sin and come short of the glory of God. And whether they did it with gritting teeth and set jaw and shaking fist, or whether they just did it all nice and sweet and refined and cultured, they still did it. And it's an equal treasonous crime, whatever their attitude was, when they did it. So the mindset of the sinner is, I am going to do what I want to do. I'm going to govern and control and rule my life. 